Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We knocked it out, no filler either. Jazbees 8-box quick hit football mixer in the books. A lot of nice stuff here. Yeah, I'm looking at it. It is going to be a pretty quick break. All cards ship, and it's a Jersey Fest break, so at the end I'll randomize everybody's names, and the name on top will get a ticket to Jersey Fest, and you'll get yourself an authentic jersey. Thanks everyone for getting in. Appreciate it. It's a Fanatics Authentic Autograph Jersey. It's gonna be pretty nice. All right, let's do uh, select draft picks first. And you know what, let me, give me a second here. Let me pull up a quick little checklist here. Groupbreakchecklist.com, football, select draft. Go by that checklist here. Good luck, everybody. All right, we've got a nice Chris Olave to lead things off. And we got a Roger McCreary autograph. And that, and he is a Titan, Matthew, with the Tennessee Titans. Tighten up. Got DK Metcalf, Sam Howell, Philip Rivers, nice Malik Willis. Also for the Titans. Liberty, Liberty, Liberty. Got a Desmond Ritter here for the ATL. And David Bell, who I believe is a Brown, a Cleveland Brown. That's right, he is. That's for Eric. Eric B. and the Browns. Cleveland, this is for you. I don't know what his snap count has been, but I, I believe he's been, he has been playing, right? It's not like he's a practice squad guy or anything. I'm pretty sure he's been on the field. All right, nice Joe Burrow for the Bengals. Five out of 75. It's going to go to Frank. Oh, and a redemption coming up. Derek Seenley Jr. for Houston. We've got Jahan Dotson Gold, 6 out of 10 for Washington. Ooh. And a nice Matt Corral collar wheel. Which is a, uh, I think it's got to be a short print in this set too, right? Panthers. Nice. Kyle with Carolina. Jahan Dotson to 10 for Washington. That's for Brody. And the Redemption, I think, is a bird team. Yeah, it's Kyle Hamilton. Rookie auto for the Purple Birds. That's going to be for Eric Houston. There you go, Eric. You're welcome, Kyle. Got my purple pen for the purple birds. There we go. Jalen Tolbert for the Cowboys. AJ Brown. Blah, 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 blah. There. College. College stuff. Done. All right, now the uh, rest of it should be all pro gear. Let's go with Elite. Two autographs, one memorabilia card per box on average. We'll get the uh, sort of, I think this might be the base heaviest. 
one right there. We'll get the base heavier stuff out of the way first. Who does everyone have tonight? Atlanta is in Carolina. You can vote in our poll. Vote in our poll. And let's talk about it. 70% of voters are on Atlanta minus two and a half. For, what it's, well, for whatever it's worth, I'm on Carolina, the short home dog, plus two and a half. I think it's sort of a, an oppo public pick. I, I generally like the home dog, the short home dog, especially on a short week, Thursday night. Although Atlanta didn't really have to travel too far. But also a... Uh, you know, I always lean underdog for uh, divisional matchups like the this NFC South matchup. Card chip in this, right? Yeah, all card chip in this uh, in this quick mixer here. I guess for the neutral fan, not Atlanta, Carolina, not super exciting. But might not Thursday nights might not be the best game, but it's the only game. We're on, we'll watch it. All right. Good luck, everyone. We got a David Ojabo to 9.99. Darren Waller going on the IR. Adjust your lineup. Although, if you have Darren Waller, then you've been you've been working without him for a little while. There's a Nicobe Dean, 51 out of 99. Hunter Renfro also out for my Raiders IR. Both of those guys will be out for four weeks. In the short term IR. I think Cordero Patterson's back for the ATL. Raider Nation may melt down if uh, if the Raiders lose to the Colts. Jeff Saturday's Colts in Vegas. Isaiah Spiller, Chargers, Matt Bristow with the Bolts. Although, if you're into this sort of thing, there may be a buying opportunity for the Raiders. I feel like, I don't know how much the line move. Maybe it really hasn't. 37 out of 90. Here's the die cut for Tim. But if the line has has moved enough to make the Raiders, I don't know, if the line's moved the other way in favor of the Colts, it might, that might be a good buying opportunity for the Raiders because they've been without those guys for a big chunk of time anyway, so it's not like it's a big loss. To 999, Romeo Dobbs, Packers, Patrick Mahomes. Got a Roger McCreary for the Titans, 399. Kyler Murray. Joe Burrow O to 349. And we got turn of the century autograph. Aiden Hutchinson. Nice. 128 out of 199 for Detroit. Eric with the Lions. Jerry Judy uh, to 49, bottom left hand corner right on his foot. So there, hopefully a, a steady diet of Josh Jacobs will be what the what the Raiders need to do. There's Malik Willis. Fantasy-wise, Matt Collins might not be a bad pickup. Drake London, 390. If you're doing like daily fantasy, could be a nice little sleeper pick. There's Craftsman, Aaron Jones, 
26 out of 99. Hmm, a little bit of a dent right there. In the crease, you see that right where the relic window is? 26 out of 99, that's it. Just letting you know, Matt Arnold, Packers. Got Michael Pittman Jr. to 399. Drake London to 999. Yeah, Matt Collins may be a little boomer bust, but if it's like a, if you need a bi week receiver to shove into a flex spot or something like that, or maybe a boomer bust player in daily fantasy, that might be the guy. All right, let's get into some chronic. So here we're looking for two autographs and one memorabilia card. This is 2021. What are, uh, what are some matchups that people are looking forward to this weekend? This is my Friday, your Thursday, but my Friday. So this is a good time to kind of preview some matchups. But I'll be back here on Sunday with you. Hockey did sell out. That's awesome. All right, there's a Germany game. Seattle at Tampa Bay. I forgot that game's in Germany. I will not be awake for that. 6.30 my time. But I'm sure the, hi the highlights will be delightful, I'm sure. There's Kyle Pitts for the ATL. Timeless Treasures Relic, 180 out of 399. Aaron with the Falcons. Got some Callum Mond. And a nice Trevor Lawrence. 110 out of 199. Jaguars. That'll be for Dayton and the Jags. Cool looking parallel there. There's his teammate, Travis Etienne, who I week by week, looks like he's just getting better and better. So that's good for the hobby. We got Rashad Bateman to 99 for the Ravens. There's Etienne again. And a Jeremy Shockey autograph, a little blast from the past, 20 out of 25. Yeah, yeah. New York football giants, Adam Kupperman. I need Jamar Chase to come back soon for my fantasy team. And turn of the century, autograph Jalen Waddle, rookie auto. 22 out of 25. Who's got the Dolphins? Christopher with the Dolphins. Nice. All right, we got a Najee Harris, rookie card for the Steelers for Eric. Got a Devonta Smith rookie card to 199 for the High Flying Eagles, Matthew, and a Luminance Trevor Lawrence rookie card, which I think looks really sharp. Gilo saying another good matchup this week will be Black Panther versus Namor. 
Is that out this? Is that out this weekend? All right, what about some uh, Clearly Donruss 2021? Any other good matchups? Minnesota Buffalo, that, that could be interesting, uh, although Josh Allen might be out. Detroit at Chicago. And Justin Fields has been running the heck out of the ball, so maybe that's just might be a matchup just to see Justin Fields run around. Denver at Tennessee, man. Jacksonville, Kansas City. Hmm. Cleveland at Miami, Houston at New York, Saints at Pittsburgh, Colts at um, at in Vegas, Dallas at Green Bay. Uh, McCarthy returned to Green Bay. Arizona at Los Angeles, Chargers at San Francisco. I don't know. None of these matchups really jump out to me. Washington at Philadelphia. We got a, out of 99, Rashad Bateman. Mac Jones rated rookie. And we got a Tillon Wallace autograph for the Ravens. That's going to be for Eric Houston. Dave Chappelle and Blackstar on SL this weekend. I'll catch the clips on Sunday. Jalen Waddle right here. Yeah, I guess no one's interested in it. I asked everybody what their uh, what the highlights were this this weekend. No one's really moving no no matchups moving the needle. G Lo instead is gonna gonna watch the new Black Panther movie and Mike's more interested in the uh, the SNL host. None of the football matchups moving the needle for anybody. I guess I don't blame you. All right, two autographs, two mem cards, two autos, two mems, two Belias. Good luck. Yeah, Gilo's saying that Sunday night game might be the only game worth watching, right? Chargers at Niners. I mean, aside from your own teams, you know what I mean? Like, like. All right, certified. Got Kenneth Walker the third. Nice RPA, freshman fabric, three color patch and auto, 149 out of 299. I guess you would, I guess you'd watch some some of these matchups just for some of these individuals. Kenneth Walker has been really been taking steps forward with each week. So he'll be in that Germany game, Seattle at Tampa Bay. So hopefully he does well there. There's Amir White. I mean, with the Raiders season pretty much done, I'd love to. I'd love to see Zamir White get some more get some more touches. I know Josh Jacobs been playing well, but let's see what we got in Zamir White. It's Corey Davis to 149. That will be for the Jets. That's going to be for Nicholas. We got Jason Witten. That's a three out of three. That's Tim's buddy, Dylan, with the Cowboys. Now, Dylan, out of fives and under, get the world-famous train whistle. I don't know if Tim's told you about this, but the, the world-famous train whistle. Got a nice, uh, the YS of Cowboys right there. Jason Witten, legend. I think Dylan's a Cowboys fan. So there you have it, Dylan. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. Nice. Let's 
Chris Godwin to 349. Drake London to 199. Miles Garrett numbered? No. And an Eli Mitchell autograph. Mirror signature, 62 out of 99. He's supposed to be making his way back soon. Eli Mitchell, Chris with the Niners. There he is. Congrats, Dylan. There's Matthew Stafford to 149. And there's Aiden Hutchinson to 349. Now, Dylan, I, I know this, I think Tim was telling, telling us this is your first break. It's not usually that easy to hit like that. Eric with the Lions. All right, just a few boxes to go. Just a few quick boxes to go, ladies and gentlemen. All right, got some contenders optic. Put two autos in here. Yeah, Wolfpack will tell you it's not easy. New guy mojo, though, seems to be seems to be in full effect. We've got two. Yeah, we've got two cards on the bottom. Javante Williams, Optic Illusion, Darius Leonard. That's to one seventy five. Mike was asking earlier, better chance of Jaguars beating the Chiefs or the Raiders beating the Colts? I think the Raiders beating the Colts is definitely a better chance. That's Kadarius Toney, uh, who's with the Chiefs now. But that'll still go to the Giants. And your two autos, it's Jamar Jefferson. Rookie ticket autograph for the Lions. That's for Eric. And Quiddy Pay, speaking of the Colts, rookie ticket autograph. Yeah, the Colts and the Raiders are two below average teams battling each other. You know what I mean? You're talking about the Jaguars, who are promising, but are also just an average team facing one of the best teams in the league. I think it'll be a lot, be a lot tougher for, um, for Jacksonville to beat the Chiefs. All right, some elements, 2022 elements. A couple fat cards on the bottom there. Oh, that's an autograph on the bottom. Let me just hide that. All right, so behind Christian Watson is George Pickens. One out of 74, that is gonna be for the Steelers, Eric. And behind Christian Watson, who'll go to the Packers, Matt Arnold, is a Tyquan Thornton. Nice colors there in that uh, that supercharged insert set here. Four color patch. Looks real sharp. And that is 14 out of 27. Karen with her Patriots. The next one is Jameson Williams. Neon, rookie neon signs. Gold ink autograph. I've been stashing him in my IR spot all season long. Could be, I don't know, an interesting stash, I want to say. Could help in the playoffs. Your fantasy football playoffs, who knows. 8 out of 35, and that will be for Detroit. That'll be for Eric. And the plate auto is Steel Signatures Marshall Yonda. For the Purple Birds, that's going to go to Eric Houston. Twenty-eight out of ninety-nine. Christian Watson, thirty-seven out of fifty-four. And we're gonna close with a nice box here. Twenty twenty-one Panini one football. The one that started off all the other ones. Is he a mustache? I don't know if he has a mustache.
I don't know. I, that might be an old photo, though. All right. Good luck. It's going to be for the boys. A rookie jersey and autograph, Simi Fioko. Precision autograph. 77 out of 99. So there you go. That's for Dylan and the Dallas Cow. I'm actually on the Cowboys this week. I think they can I think they I think they're going to beat Green Bay. There you go, gang. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com and that was our 8 box quick hit football mixer. Let's give away that Jersey Fest spot. Who's going to get a ticket to Jersey Fest? Let's gather all the na names here. Na names? What was that? 1 through 32. I just went into an accent there. Um, let's gather all the names. Name on top. Just one winner. One ticket to Jersey Fest after 7. 6 and a 1. Lucky 7 for somebody. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7th and final time. After 7. Now, the worst spot is spot two, just on the outside. Matt, sorry. Very close, but no cigar. I appreciate you trying. Thanks, everyone, for trying. But only one winner, only one ticket to Jersey Fest in this break. And that's going to be for Chris. Uh, Chris G., I don't think I... He had the Colts. There may have been some numbered cards here, or maybe a relic or two, but I don't think I called your, your number too often during this break. So congrats to you. We'll see you in Jersey Fest, uh, giving away a bunch of jerseys. Check out the details, jazbeescasebreaks.com. We'll see you next time for the next one.